Hello guys, today we will be using TensorFlow in Android Studio to detect objects. But first, let us see what is meant by object detection, how it works, what is TensorFlow and then a simple method of doing this. So let's start with object detection. Object detection is a computer technology related to computer vision and image processing that deals with detecting instances of semantic objects of a certain class such as buildings, humans or cars in digital images and videos. And this can be used for multi-purposes such as face recognition, people counting, self-driving cars, security, traffic tracking, industrial quality check, tracing someone and others. Let's take an example. Self-driving cars make use of object detection technology using computer vision and image processing and determine the distance between the car and the objects which may be moving or at rest. And with help of this, it creates alerts and guides the self-driving cars. Now, the question arises, how it works. So, this technology works like this. Data is collected through computer vision. This data is then fed into the model and using machine learning algorithms, conclusions are made. The camera takes multiple images from different angles and sends those images to image processing unit. Then, based on the training data, the results are laid out to the system in the form of instructions or alerts. Now let's see what are tensors. Tensors are the standard way of representing data in deep learning. These are just multidimensional arrays, an extension of two-dimensional tables or matrices to data with higher dimensions. TensorFlow is an interface for expressing machine learning algorithms and an implementation for executing such algorithms. Now what are the application areas of TensorFlow? It builds and trains ML models easily using intuitive higher level APIs like Keras. Train and deploy models in the cloud, in the browser or on device irrespective of the language you use. Powerful experimentation for research with a simple and flexible architecture. This was all for TensorFlow. Now, let's jump onto the method for object detection. Okay, so now for the code, just open your internet and write github.com TensorFlow and examples. Open this. Now here, you can see light, just open this, then go to examples, then go to object detection, and then choose Android, because we are making on Android. So this is the package, so you just have to go to here and then just go to code and open with github desktop or just download the zip file so i have already downloaded and then extract also then open android studio Now go to open. Now here, these are the same GitHub examples, light, light, then object direction, then Android. So just open this Android. So I have already opened it. And then just make sure 
that in tools in SDK manager here all these are installed these now you can run it on this also so here it is Okay, so th this is now just press Alt and move this. So you can see this is object detection on this also you can connect your phone using USB so I'm just connecting it now again run so has opened in my device so you can see now so it is, it is detecting objects so this is how it works now let's just stop this So this was the simplest method to use object detection using TensorFlow in Android Studio. So this was all for today. Thank you guys and subscribe to my channel if you haven't and hit the like button. Thank you.